There are many common metals that come from the crust of the Earth, and one of them is uranium. This is a very heavy metal which has been used as a source of concentrated energy for decades, powering both nuclear reactors and bombs. Just like other elements, uranium occurs in slightly differing forms known as isotopes. What makes these isotopes different from one another is the number of neutral particles, or neutrons, in the nucleus. Natural uranium is a mix of two isotopes, uranium-238, accounting for more than 99%, and uranium-235, which is less than 1%. The difference in mass between these two allow them to be separated and make it possible to increase or enrich the percentage of U-235 from its natural level of 0.7% to 45%. This is done in a machine called a centrifuge, Uranium hexafluoride gas is fed into the rotating cylinder and spun at a high speed. This is what splits the molecules. The heavier U-238 molecules collect on the outside of the cylinder, and the light U-235 molecules set closer to the middle. The gas that's slightly depleted of U-235 is sent back to previous stages, and the gas that's slightly enriched is fed to the next stage. This is done through a cascade, which is made up of hundreds or thousands of centrifuges, until it creates a gas that's highly enriched in U-235, about 90%. This is when the uranium can be used in weapons. Mm -hmm.